Hey everybody, it's Brian Colin here. It's Friday. It's the just about the end of the week, right before a long holiday weekend here in the States. And DHL just dropped this off on my porch. I've not opened it up. I've not looked at it. You're going to be here with me as I break into this bag. I'm going to try and be gentle with this because I don't want to accidentally cut any of the books. Uh, but I'm going to start slowly opening it up. Sorry for the wobbliness of the camera. The uh, thing I have hanging attached to my desk is uh, is very loose. Okay, so then we got, whoa, there we go. It's not loose, it's just the slightest adjustment will, uh, will make it bounce. Okay, I'm gonna try and just do some light cuts on the bubble wrap to make sure that I'm not, I don't cut into any of the books because or any of the products, because this is one set of prototypes. And by prototypes, these are not on the actual finished presses. Um, a lot of the, the finishing work is not the final work, but it's enough to review, approve, or say something needs to change, make sure sizes are correct on everything. Pop that open. Sounds like fireworks, it's so explosive. Let's see, another little cut here. Another little, I'm seeing vibrant colors coming through already, which is exciting. And then, let's see. Let's see. And I don't wanna bend anything too much or cut into anything too hard. Go. Almost there. Up to here. And then I think now we can unroll everything. Okay. I'm going to look at. Wow, that is wonky. Shifted really wonky. I wonder if that is just from the. Uh, just from packaging or what? Because that. Holy smokes. You see that foil? Hot diggity. That is pretty. Exalted Funeral and Creature Curation on there. Let's see, we got the, the Molt Core book. Looking pretty awesome. And then we got the character sheets. All right, character sheets are looking good. GM screen. I'm going to have to take some pictures of that before I open it up. Um, let's go ahead and, whoa, wonky, sorry. I'll go ahead and open up the main book real quick. Colors are really vibrant, popping. It's got the nice soft touch laminate, which I love. Uh, it's looking pretty good. I'm going to have to spend some time going through all of this, making sure everything looks right, and then send this on to Exalted Funeral for review. And like I said, this is not the, the finished printing, and it's not the, the finished uh, binding and everything like that, but it should be pretty close to be able to... Uh, I wonder why that was there. I'm going to leave that there just in case, uh, just in case there were some notes. But as you know, it's a, it's a little, uh, just make sure it's pretty darn close to what it, the final's gonna be. And then we've got character sheets. All right, I'll pop these open. And then I need to take some pictures of the GM screen before I open that up. So uh, I'll cut the video, take some pictures, then I'll start up a video, splice it together got the character sheets. Look at that. It slides in and out of there real easy. Those are going to work well, but I'm going to have to test them, test the paper, do some writing on it, um, make sure everything looks great like that. Um, and slide that back in there for future reference. Boom. 
All right, putting these next to each other. These are looking pretty good. They sit snug together. Gonna look good on a shelf together. Let's put that one on a shelf together. And I think once the, the wrap is off of that one, I think that's gonna, let's go ahead and do that too. Oops. Now the, uh, the texture of the paper of the faux lizard skin on this, it's not quite as big as I thought it was gonna be. I thought the, the texture would be larger. Um, thought they'd be larger textures, but all in all, it's pretty cool. All right. And then of course, this is gonna be the same interior as the rest of it. Shiny, 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 shiny. All right, that's it. I'll cut another one in here once I take some pictures of the GM screen. So here I am back with the GM screen. I figured out why it was so wonky in their packaging. It was just folded incorrectly when it was originally put into the sleeve. And, I, and that's easy enough to fix. Like, cause as you can see now, it's not super, super crooked. And I think it also needs to, whoop, the sleeve needs to be tightened up a little bit. So with that, um, the reason is this has to fold with two flaps on the left and then three flaps on the right. And then it all works out just fine. Um, I need to review all of this copy, make sure everything looks good, but you know, initial glance, just taking a look at it visually, it's a pretty crazy GM screen. It's pretty bitchin', I love it. All right, thank you everybody for tuning in. I will have an update once I know more about uh, production schedule and all that, but once we approve these, they should be ready to start uh, going to print. All right, thanks everybody.